so uh, we continue from uh, page number 47 now from the para so hugged john c so uh, she was glad to see the change in john c and uh, she got up for her and gave her a mirror to tidy her hair and now uh, john c sounded happy and joyful <clears throat> next para in the afternoon so the doctor visited that afternoon and said that uh, the desire to live was back in john c and he was sure that uh, she would uh, recover soon he went uh, down stairs to check uh, mr behman who was also suffering from pneumonia and uh, there was no hope for him to recover the next morning when she was sitting beside john c telling her that behman passed away and could not survive his illness pneumonia he had been ill for the last two days and the caretaker of the building found him lying in his bed in a deteriorating condition and his clothes and shoes were also wet and he was uh, shivering too badly since he was out all night uh, during the storm so the next para then they found a ladder a ladder and a lantern were lying near his bed paint brushes green and yellow colored paint were also lying nearby and so asked john c now to closely look at the leaf because it was not fluttering or moving about when the wind was blowing that was very astonishing and uh, so continues it was the masterpiece that behman wanted to paint in his life he painted this one just to save you he sacrificed his life by painting his masterpiece but at the cost of his own life so the story ends here but lesson doesn't so the lesson that uh, we learn from this story is uh, to uh, sacrifice life uh, for others including those who either do not want to live for any reason or who think that their life is over or those who are made to believe that they are good for nothing or useless we can make them realize their value and worth in in our eyes it needs sincere efforts and sacrifice and at times we may have to sacrifice even our own life so uh, this uh, is story and say hope you enjoy this story and uh, see you again in the uh, next class bye for now